happy Saturday! Join me in this artsy, crafty, fun, and yummy weekend as we learn how to create different, creative, and meaningful projects. I am Teacher Alex and this is Teacher Bibao Weekend Special, where we will engage in experiments, explore do-it-yourself activities, and many more. Craving for something sweet but you do not want to spend lots of money? Well, this episode is really for you! For today, we will make easy-to-prepare desserts that you and your family will surely love. Excited to try these treats? Come on and let's begin! The first dessert that we are going to make is a refrigerator cake. Making a refrigerator cake is pretty easy. That is why it has become one of our favorites to prepare on a different occasions or even just for satisfying our sweet cravings. What's great about a refrigerator cake is that we can put different toppings according to our preference. For today, we are going to prepare a crowd favorite, mango float or mango graham cake. But first, what is a mango graham cake? Why is it called mango float? Is it because mangoes are floating on cream that looks like clouds? I really have no idea. The bottom line is, it's simply a mango refrigerator cake or an icebox cake made of graham crackers. So this means no cooking, no baking, just refrigerating. Whatever you decide to call this dessert, one thing's for sure, it's very easy to make. Are you ready? Let's begin! The ingredients that we will be needing are the following. All-purpose cream, sweetened condensed milk, graham crackers, and fresh ripe mangoes. What are the tools that we need to make a mango refrigerator cake? Well, we don't need special tools to make this cake either. We just need a big container, a few spoons, a knife, and of course our ingredients. Now get ready because I will show you the steps in making your own ref cake. Mix the all-purpose cream with your condensed milk in a bowl. Cut the ripe mangoes. Cut the sides. Use a spoon to take off the mango from its peel. Then, cut it with the thickness that you want. Just be careful in using the knife or ask help from adults kids. We don't want any accidents while making this easy recipe. Prepare a baking dish or just a reusable food container. Arrange the first layer of graham crackers. Pour your mixture of all-purpose cream and condensed milk. Add some mangoes. Repeat steps 4 to 6 for 2 to 3 times until we create 3 to 4 layers. You don't want it to be super thick so your family will surely come back for more. Once done, Cover the container and chill it overnight to set completely before serving. Ta-da! You now have your own mango graham cake. It's so easy, right? Now we can prepare yummy desserts without hurting our budget. And for sure, your family would want to eat this with you, especially after eating meals. Are you craving for something bitter and sweet? If yes, then coffee jelly is for you. Want to know how to make your own coffee jelly? Alright, let's get started! In making coffee jelly, here are what we need. All-purpose cream, sweetened condensed milk, unflavored gelatin, and of course, coffee! Now, ready to begin! Prepare the gelatin mixture. Follow the procedure written on its packaging. Pour your coffee and stir. Then, Pour your mixture in a shallow container. Set aside. Mix your all-purpose cream and condensed milk in a separate container. 
Once your gelatin mixture sets, cut it into small cubes. Mix the jelly cubes in your all-purpose cream and condensed milk mixture. If you are not into drinking coffee, then eating this coffee jelly is for you. Now, on to the next refrigerated treat. Are you ready? Let's begin! When summer comes, I remember those childhood days when I hurriedly collect coins from my parents' cabinet to buy this thirst-quenching summer snack. Ice candy. Whatever the flavor is, there will always be magic in every bite. A truly refreshing means to beat the heat of the summer. But we don't have to wait for the summer to enjoy this treat. Now, let's make our own ice candy. For our ice candy, we will be needing evaporated milk, sweetened condensed milk, fruit cocktail drained, reserve some fruit syrup, and ice candy bag. Let's begin! First, combine milk and reserved fruit cocktail syrup. Mix well and set aside. Next, fill each ice candy bag with fruits. Then, fill with milk mixture. Lastly, seal and freeze overnight. Wow! I'm sure every bite of this ice candy will bring back your happy childhood memories. Enjoy this best with your loved ones. That's it for today. I hope you had a yummy weekend with me. Again, I am Teacher Alex reminding you that we don't need to spend a lot of money on our desserts. We just need to be creative and practical. This could be a great family bonding too. See you again next week for more fun DIY videos here in Teacher Vival Weekend Special. Thank you.